why are you so confused listen listen up you're confused we live in a world that confuses fat for muscle two to three weeks vacation with financial freedom two three weeks vacation a year with financial freedom an income tax check and a small ass savings with wealth hmm why are we so confused i'll tell you where it started though it started in public school you see because all we had to do was show up we showed up to school we got in line raised our hands whenever before we wanted to use the restroom they told us when to show up told us what time to eat we went we changed classes got back in line and got picked up like little soldiers little slaves and we passed just by showing up what could have been taught in two three hours we we're there eight ten hours a day in school so now we live our life like that we show up to the gym we buy nice gym clothes and we show up and we think that just going to the gym, just showing up, we're gonna freaking get jacked. I just left the gym right now, I see it every time. Dude walks up to me at my, my, my bench trying to take my weight off. I got 645s on there and some more. I'm like, hold on, dude. And I'm thinking, this dude, he's about to hit some real weight. He's in a rush. Nah, he goes put some little bitch weight on the machine. I'm like, nah, I'm using this one. He goes put some little bitch weight. He's done before me made me think about that. Why are people so confused? We think if we show up, it's enough. It ain't enough, man. Till this day, if I'm sitting in the living room with my wife or my family, whoever, and I need to go to a restroom, I let everybody know I'm gonna go to the restroom real quick. Why I do that? Why, why can't I just get up, go to the restroom, come back? Because in public school for 12 damn years, you have to ask to go to the restroom. So it becomes a habit. You probably do the shit too, don't even realize. Why you, why you, I'm, I'm gonna go to the restroom real quick in your own house. I'll be right back. Like you need to ask for permission. Dudes at the gym look like, look great with a shirt on, take their shirt off, look like shit. Say, yeah, I'm about 12% body fat. You're like 28% body fat. Confusing fat for muscle. Come on, man. We save up a little bit of money. We think we're financial free. We get two, three weeks vacation a year. We think we made it. We've been conditioned to believe that we got it made, man. We don't. I'm all about pushing the limits. I'm that dog that you can't keep in the fence. Oh, don't walk out the fence. Don't leave the fence. I'm that bird you put in the cage, but he knows he's a bird you're meant to fly. Some of you guys got wings. You're confused. We confuse Netflix and video games with real life. We confuse Instagram. We're talking with, with girls just because we see their photos or we, we, we send a like or a comment. Don't confuse, man. Don't confuse the fantasy world with, with reality. Reality is if you want to lift and get jacked, you got to push weight. If you want true financial freedom, you need to measure your time. If you only have one source of income and they got rid of you tomorrow and that's all you have coming in, you're not financially free. If you're not making money while you're just going running around, you're not financially free. If I can't see your abs, listen to me. If I can't see your abs, you you got a lot of body fat on you. Like we need to stop confusing. If you go to the gym and you push around lightweight, you're never gonna get jacked. If you're not really pushing, if you don't sweat when you lift weights, cause you're pushing so much weight, you're pushing for your life. You're never gonna get jacked. They're gonna come home, you're gonna blame your genetics or some bullshit, watch some YouTube video, make you feel good. Don't be confused, man. If you like this video, like it, drop a comment, post a video every day, subscribe to the channel. We'll be back tomorrow.